It was clear for both teams in the final game of the under-15 Jerry Thompson Premier Division. Ardoin just needed to avoid defeat to win the league, with Knockbreda sitting two points behind them. Knockbreda started the game brightly. Daniel Riley with this shot that hit the side netting. Shortly after, they went 1-0 in front. Connor Nelson picked the ball up in midfield before passing to Leighton Hutton. He unleashed a strike from outside of the area that was out of reach for Ardoin keeper Oshin Copeland. They had a fantastic chance to double their lead. Mackenzie Gray doing well down the right-hand side. His cross found Shawnee Dugan at the back post. The forward completely missed the ball as Ardoin cleared. Hutton, having already scored from distance, had a go once more. The Ardoin keeper watched as it went wide of the target. Caelan Hardy had this go for Ardoin, but it didn't trouble the keeper. Minutes later, Ardoin attacked once more. Callum Trainer hit this shot with Venom. Taylor Beattie down to make the save. The shot stopper was called into action once more. Ardoin putting a lot of balls into the box. This fell for Hardy on the edge. A strong hand from the keeper denied the midfielder. Trainer Smith and Captain McKinney all had a go next for Ardoin inside the box. Knockbreeder with some brave defending to prevent them from scoring as they went in at half-time, 1-0 in front. Part bit of defending here early in the second half from Hardy, as Copeland came to gather. And at the other end, Hardy put this inviting ball into the box. It wasn't met by an Ardoin teammate, though. As the North Belfast side searched for that equaliser, they were attempting shots from all ranges. Donald McAlee this time, not troubling Beatty in goal. Whilst an operator effort from Riley went high over the crossbar. The fingertips of Oshin Copeland stopped Nockbreda from making it 2-0 in this winner-take-all game, this time denying Charlie McCamley with a superb save. That gave Ardoin the hope they needed. As shortly after, Hardy's inch-perfect cross was headed home by substitute Aaron Braniff as he made it minutes ticking by and the pressure lifting for both sides Ardoin went in front Barry McCurvey's in swinging corner was headed into his own goal by Aaron Murray Balls reined in in the Ardoin box as Nockbreda in search of a goal. Mackenzie Gray had this shot saved by Copeland. Dugan was on hand to tap home the rebound to level the scores at 2-2. But Nockbreda need the win. Rub salt in the wounds of Nockbreda following that goal. Hardy took it upon himself to put Ardoin 3-2 in front. Excellent bit of play by the midfielder. And a finish that Beattie couldn't quite keep out. Ray had this long-range strike for Breda, saved by Copeland down to his right. Out 
However, in the dying minutes, he did get on the score sheet, the level. Getting on the end of this cross to volley home. There just wasn't enough time left for Nockbreda as the referee blew for full time. 3-3 it ended. A point not enough for Nockbreda, but the point that secured Ardoin the under-15s, Jerry Thompson, Premier Division.